I, th I think this whole escalation of uh, the nuclear arms race that's kicking into gear again is just as unconscionable and sociopathic as what we did to those people there. And, you know, I recall the most uh, epiphany moment of that last presidential election when I recall seeing Pres uh, candidate Trump going to some sort of a rally in Indianapolis, I think it was, Indiana, and Bobby Knight was introducing him to the crowd, Coach Bobby Knight of the Hoosiers, and he said, I want to introduce you to the man who's not afraid to push the button. What does that mean? And I, I finally started to understand that this is just, we're living in a constant state of fear. I mean, we, we always know we're living in constant state of fear, but the fear that this brings on of global just annihilation at the, the disposal of one person who has that arbitrary decision-making authority to just push the button is, I think, um, needs to be corrected. So that is what this joint memorial does, is it requests Congress to put some checks and balances on this unilateral authority to create war. And it, it doesn't prohibit, it doesn't go farther than that to say that he cannot defend uh, as a retaliatory measure, um, but as a first strike measure, yes. That, that's just too much authority.